morning. I got back from London last night, like, and I just hit the ground running. I came home, I had to do so much laundry, and I'm about to walk out of the door because I'm going to Santa Cruz for my surf camp for five days. <clears throat> As you can tell, I'm kind of coming down with a cold. I've been fighting it, so fingers crossed that, like, we're okay. I have been also experiencing some, like, crazy night sweats. I don't know what's going on like I wake up soaked it happened the last two nights in London and then it happened again last night and I don't know what is happening um so yeah fingers crossed that everything is good but yes we're gonna go I'm really excited I hope I have the energy to surf this week so come with me I just bought this suitcase and then my carry-on so let's go all right, we made it to the airport. I'm about to board my flight. I am so exhausted from this time exchange, but this is gonna be so much fun. I'm so excited. If you guys, again, aren't familiar, this is called First Descents. It's for cancer patients, it's for caretakers, it's for those who are dealing with uh, multiple sclerosis, and it's a free trip. They're paying for literally everything. We're staying in a big house, we're gonna be surfing all week. I applied for this excursion, I got accepted, and they're paying for literally everything. So I'm so excited. Um, I guess after this, I'm just gonna be like the next couple later. Bye. Oh, look, but you got a little fuzzy there, too. Who? On your camera. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so you. Just got to that. One of the houses. We got the chef. Chefin. The little app table. So cute. Oh, okay. Honor, we saw where you lived. Say hi to the camera. Hi! <laughs> Is that like for the apps table? What's your name? <laughs> Henny, because he loves Hennessy. What's your name? Cece or Chanel. Or a, a variety of other things. Or C, C as in yes, yes. C squared. <laughs> or doubles, double C's. <laughs> what? That sounded like disease. Double the C's. <laughs> No. What's your name? What's your name? Grizzly. Grizzly. Bear. Sounded like Grizzly. Bear. Grizzly. Part of the reality show is this. This is your confessional. We're living in a reality home. Oh, wow. So, I heard you and Grizzly almost got into a fist fight. What happened? Keeping that on the low. <laughs> what do you have to confess? You're not making exciting reality TV. Who are you keeping? Oh yeah, this is Love Island. Yeah. Who's your crush? <laughs> That's why I we've made it. I made a bracelet and it was the most stressful thing in the world. It took us 900 years to tie this thing. We have an arts and crafts table over here. Hi guys, this is for the vlog. This is for the YouTube. <laughs> I'm not presentable. Oh my god, you look cute. Look at what her bracelet is doing. Oh, my you feet. made it an anklet. I did, I did. Not for free. Look at our gorgeous abode. Oh, what? The shed goes in for a Shut up. That's so funny. Oh, it's that's like what that door was? Well, your camera Me and skates. Hello. Yeah, it's to eliminate the wind. This is for YouTube. For YouTube? Yeah. Exciting. Yeah. Yeah. Who are you? Who are you? My name's, are you? <laughs> My name's Honey. I'm putting the, our stuff together and then we'll come fetch you when it's. There we go. You have to do the conga though in the line to wait for food. <laughs> Yeah, I got it. I did it.
first dinner. Oh, so are they some mosquitoes that I'm Skeeters. Are you recording as you sing and taking on my Yeah. Tell me it's back on. Turn around. <laughs> <laughs> We just got back from our first day of surfing! I don't know if she just dropped my phone. I'm with Skates. Say hi. hi. We all got nicknames yesterday. We had to pick our own nicknames. This is Che. Hi. We're the LA girlies. LA girlies. My nickname is Honey for Honey Luscious Muffin Head, which was my nickname as a kid. Oh, wait, really? And my honey skin tone. Why. Yeah. <laughs> No, and I hated Honey Luscious Muffin Head as a kid, but I couldn't think of anything. Nothing was resonating, so. That's so fun. It's so embarrassing. Like, I would forget my school lunch, and they would, my, my parents would bring me my lunch to school, and they would put HLMH oh on the, like, brown paper sack. That's so cute. Yeah. How was surfing today, girls? Really fun. Good. So tiring, Yeah, though. for real. So we're gonna be so sore like it took yeah. so much effort just to like swim out there my shoulders and my traps and also like my neck I'm nervous about my neck because of my scoliosis so like keeping your head up the whole time yeah. on the board yeah. I didn't think about that but yeah yeah so anyway so we're just getting ready and then we're gonna go eat some dinner in a bit peace yeah. I know this is kind of Say hi. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so much footage of that. Hi, Jacob. We're going on a hike. I thought it was so back We're going on a hike. Looking crazy. Day two, we're sore from surfing, but we're gonna go hike for some elephant seals. <laughs> wow, surfing. You speak Japanese? What, wow. Mine? <laughs> Those look like pelicans, but what are they? Um, Caspian terns, black oyster catchers, garbled, marbled godwit. How the hell do you know that? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I'm just gonna bird. Just bird. The birds. The birds just the bears, skim in the water. This the is like National bears, Geographic. The bears, the bears. We're out here, look at the birds can hear the seals. I think they're all the way over yonder. All right, Skates, what are your thoughts? Oh my God, here. No seals, not enough seals. I know. Yeah. Grizzy, what are you thinking? Are you gonna move here? I'd love to move here. He's coming here Just straight. Just me, the seals, bird poop. <laughs> love it. Love it. And I kind of want to fall <laughs> Turn around Woo! And then they want us to surf after this We just hiked Ugh! We're gonna be dead We're gonna be fit queens after this Situation I woke up and my bottom lip is so swollen. Look at that. Aww. My friend in high school used to sing this song, Girl, shake your bottom lip. Your bottom lip. Girl, shake your bottom lip. What? <laughs> I'm telling you guys that. Huh? I don't know that. Cause she, like, she had a really big bottom lip, so she was just like, your bottom lip's sick. How are you guys feeling today? It's Wednesday, day two. Day three. I feel insane. Oh my god. I'm gonna smash my makeup off. You put makeup on to go surfing? No, I'm not makeup. No, for the picture. I'm not makeup. <laughs> I should have washed up. I just washed up. And I'm just gonna wipe this off. Oh my god. Okay. Just got back from 
surfing. This is day three, it's Wednesday. We have two more days before we leave and this has just been like such a, such an amazing trip. I think today it's like really hit me the most listening to people's stories, like having the small conversations and hearing what they're going through is just like so admirable. I was talking to one of the guys today, his name is Prince and he has stage four terminal brain cancer. And you would have never known, like just talking to him and his enthusiasm and his sarcasm and just like his joy for life, just really, I don't know, put things into perspective. And when he was telling me his story that like basically no one lives from his cancer I like walked away from the conversation and just tears were just rolling down my face and I just I don't know it hit something in me and like even though I'm going through cancer like I see someone else's journey and I'm just like you are such a fighter and you're just doing things that you want to do and life is so short and it's important to just I don't know, like, get to know the people around you and take advantage of life because we're not guaranteed anything and like, even though we have cancer, like, we can get in a car accident tomorrow and it could be over and so this place has just been amazing getting to meet so many people who are going through something so similar to you but yet are so beautiful and so inspiring and so positive and uplifting. And it's really true that like cancer does change the way that you think because I have felt it in myself, how like I view life so differently. And now seeing people around me who emulate how I feel is just really beautiful. And I'm just grateful to be here. Like the surf camp is amazing. And I, it's literally like, created such a new passion for something that I've never done and I can't wait to continue this so yeah I'm just very grateful that I was chosen to be here and if you get a chance to come to First Descents like you have to do it like this is such a beautiful place for people who it's not just like a charity a charity event that they're doing for cancer cancer patients or people who've gone through cancer like Everyone who, most of the people who've worked here have also gone through cancer and I just think that that's so beautiful because the, those that are leading us have been in our shoes and have been on this side of the First Descents trip. So, yeah, I don't know. I just, today, something really shifted in me and I'm just so grateful. So grateful. Challenging but really fun. Another one where you're like Indian Can I get after it? Yeah. On fire time. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see it. Divine. Uh, did you have it? Did you take a sip? That's your home. It's delicious. 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 delicious.